Hello guys, my name is Luisia. In this video, I'm going to show you a recently found bug with the snowball items in League of Legends. If you're unfamiliar with these so-called snowball items, I'll give you a short explanation. There are currently two snowball items in League of Legends. The first one and more common one is Magi's Soul Stealer, and the other one is called Sword of the Occult. Magi's Soul Stealer gives you 20 ability power, and whenever you kill or gain an assist on an enemy champion, you get stacks on this item. A kill gives you 2 stacks, while assists give you 1 stack. The maximum number of stacks on these items are 20 stacks. Each stack is worth 8 ability power, meaning that a fully stacked Magi's will give you a bonus of 160 AP, as well as a bonus effect of 15% cooldown reduction. Sword of the Occult works exactly the same way, but gives you attack damage instead of ability power. It stacks up to 20 times, a kill is worth 2 stacks, and an assist is worth 1 stack. However, each stack on Sword of the Occult only gives you 5 bonus attack damage compared to Magi's 8 ability power. Which means that a full stacked sword only gives you 100 bonus AD and a bonus effect which gives you 15% bonus movement speed. In order for this bug to work, you need to get at least one kill or assist after buying your snowball item. After that, recall to your base and sell your snowball item, and then buy it back using the newly implemented reverse action button. Pay attention to my stats while I'm doing this. It doesn't affect your stacks, though, until you actually kill an enemy. It doesn't always work the first time you try it, and you won't be able to stack it all the way up to 20 right away. I'm also buying an amplifying tome here, in order to purchase Mjai's Soul Stealer later. Once I've killed the Sona bot again, I recall to base to repeat what I did earlier. Also note that you can now see the correct number of stacks that I have on my sword. After just selling the sword once, I immediately reached 20 stacks, which you can notice since my movement speed increased quite a lot. So now, it's time to see how fast we can stack Midgai's Soul Stealer as well. So I go out and kill Sona once again in order to be able to sell Midgai's to get more stacks. I sell the item a few times in order to increase the number of stacks as much as I possibly can. I take a look at my cooldown reduction and see that I haven't reached 20 stacks yet. So I go out to kill Sona one last time. There we go. We can now see that I have 14 stacks on Magi's after killing Sona. Time to get back to base. I then sell Magi's and reverse the action one last time and I manage to reach 20 stacks on both snowball items with only 5 kills. However, the main reason why I'm making this video is to get people's attention to it, which also includes Riot so they hopefully can fix this as soon as possible. Because I'm pretty sure that no one wants to see a new meta full of buggy snowball items in League of Legends. I also highly advise you to not abuse this bug while playing against other people, since there's a very high risk of you getting reported while doing this, possibly leading to you getting banned, or even permanently banned, since your enemies, or possibly even your teammates, will most likely report you if you do this. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, make sure to like the video if you did, and share it with your friends on Facebook or send it to a friend on Skype or something. You can also click any of these videos to check out more stuff that I've made. I'm also working on a tips and tricks video with the lease, so if you don't want to miss that, make sure to subscribe to my channel for that video and more content in the future. That's all from me guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in game.